Hey everybody, it's Christopher Small, the unconventional attorney. Today, I wanna to talk to you about the, the, the most important thing when you're doing content marketing. I think that's what it is, I cannot remember what the title is. Um, but I know what I wanna say and I know what the point is. Uh, before I get to that though, I want to remind you, if you, uh, if you are having trouble following up with potential clients, with completed clients, with current clients, if you wish there was some way that you could ask clients for the documents that you need from them over and over and over again without having to literally mark it on your calendar and remember to do it every time, then I've got a special treat for you um, because I have set up a system that does all that for myself and I'm going to share it with you. Um, to get it, it's $7. You have to go to unconventionalfollowup.com. Check it out. Seven bucks. Super simple. I'll walk you through the whole thing. I share my automations with you and it's amazing. Unconventionalfollowup.com. All right. So the key to any uh, content marketing strategy, and, and, and the reason I wanna talk about this is because this is something I see people messing up all the time. And it's the main driver of the content. It's the main reason that you are creating the content. Um, but so many people mess it up because I think they wanna just give a, a bunch of different things. And um, let's just get right to it. The key to any good content marketing strategy is a strong, and consistent call to action. All right, what does that mean? If you are doing a video like this, if you heard me at the beginning, right, when I when I pointed out going to and, and checking out unconventional follow, unconventionalfollowup.com, I'm gonna do it at the end again. When I do my law firm videos, I tell people if I'm doing an estate planning video, I send them to estatemeeting.com. If I'm doing a probate video, I send them to probatemeeting.com. But it's the same thing every time. It's easy to remember, it's easy to access, and it makes it easy for people to do the next thing that I want them to do, which is to book a time to talk to me. So many of you send people to, to like, you know, cmslawfirm.com forward slash book a meeting, or you give your phone number on a video, or you uh, say something different, you send people different places with every single piece of content that you make. That is not good, okay? You wanna be consistent. If you, have a, if you have a vanity phone number, for example, that works really well, then drop that number all the time. You know, if I had if I had 206 estate plan, which is 206 is the Seattle area code, I would be saying that phone number all the time. That's all I would say. I wouldn't drive anybody anywhere else except 206 estate plan or 206 probate, right? Um, which is a seven letter uh, word. So I should go try to buy that. But um, in any event, the, the call to action is important. So if you're writing content, if you're creating content, Make sure with every single piece of content that you create, every single blog post that you write, every single ebook, every single white paper, every single magazine article, whatever, whatever you do with your content marketing strategy, make sure that you have a strong call to action. And if you can, if you're allowed, depending on where you're, where you're putting this, if you're just making it yourself, you can totally do this, work those calls to action in the middle of your content um, as well as the, out, as the end. You know, like I said, with the, do as I do as I do and as I say, right? I gave you a call to action at the beginning of this video. I'm gonna give you one at the end. Take the time to put together a vanity URL like unconventionalfollowup.com, like estatemeeting.com. That is easy to remember, it's easy to spell, and you can say over and over and over again so that people remember you when they want to go and and check your stuff out or to hire you or to book a time to talk to you. So many people I see missing out on this and then they, they, they wonder why, no, why their content isn't working. Well, you don't have a strong call to action. And by the way, to, be, to piggyback off of that, make sure where you're sending people actually works. You know, it should just go right to the scheduling page or right to whatever you want them to do. Do not send them to your homepage because then they have to figure out what to do and they're more likely to click away. All right, um, so that's it. Um, in addition to that, you should be creating content all the time the main driver of my business. Um, I do some advertising as well, but content is what makes the world go round. It establishes you as an expert. It establishes expertise. It establishes trust. It does all of the fancy things. Okay. All right. So that is it. Um, as always, if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you know someone needs to hear this, please share it with them. If you have a question or comment, please leave it. And if you don't have a follow-up system for your potential clients, for your current clients, for your past clients to keep everybody happy and to keep you from spending your days sending out check-in emails, then go to unconventionalfollowup.com. I share my entire system with you. 
So all my follow-up emails, all my checking emails, all, all of the things, I share them all with you. All my workflows, like ding, 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 ding. So I have a big series of emails. They're not just like one single email template. It's the whole, it's the whole series that you get with the workflows included, tags and everything. Unconventionalfollowup.com. Okay, um, that is it. As always, I am Christopher Small. I am the Unconventional Attorney. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your attention. I appreciate you, and I will talk to you again soon. See ya.